The victim says he'd been in his same camping spot in rural Cleveland County for about eight months with no complaints. But early Sunday morning, he was viciously attacked by two men. Michael McCauley doesn't really consider himself homeless. Just houseless. <laughs> I, I mean, I got a home. It's just not a typical home. But the place he called home is now destroyed after two men slashed his tent and tarps with knives and attacked him with metal and, pipes. Uh, they shredded my tent. I mean, they, they took razors and knives to That's where I, you know, where I lived, you know. Jamie Tedder and Carl Wilson were both arrested for the attack. McCauley says he was friends with Wilson, had originally come to Oklahoma to help him fix up his trailer four years ago. He says the attack was completely unprovoked. Minding my own business, you know, helping, helping, helping people out when they need it. I'm not surprised that that population is more vulnerable to acts of violence. Dan Strawn is the executive director of the Homeless Alliance. He says nationwide around 100 homeless people are killed every year. And he says they're always working to curb the problem. The best way to curb that problem is to get people into housing, right? So uh, where they are sheltered and they have some protection. Oh, they were trying to hurt me. Luckily, Macaulay was able to get away with only a few scrapes and bruises. Take what you can salvage and just move on, you know. Macaulay says he'd already been thinking about finding a home with four walls. Maybe I'm going to raise a family. <laughs> I don't know. Thinking about uh, giving up the, the wood. For now, he's sheltering in a nearby wooded area in a tent that someone gave him, hoping to live his simple life without anyone bothering him. Sarah Stewart, Oklahoma's News Channel 4.